saints and the rest of you people out there in the, in the land in America. I got a few things that I need to say. One of them is, I'm pissed off. That's right, I said I'm pissed off. No, no, don't. It's too late. Come on, dude, don't. It's already in motion. Well, put it out of motion. You pissed me off. Ah. I'm your, your ungrateful little nigglets. And come up here for Mother's Day. Ain't nobody got me nothing for Mother's Day. And I mean nothing, honey. I got churn all over the place. All you churn out there. None of one there. One of y'all ungrateful little nigglets ain't sending me nothing. And then the one person that I did get to send me, let me show you where that mess at, where they sent me. Just say, Happy Valentine's Day. That ain't no Mother's Day gift. Who gives somebody some two-month-old chocolate trying to say Happy Mother's Day? What kind of racket you think this is? Who the kind of person you think you fooling with, honey? You don't know me. You don't know now, honey, because I will go up and off up in this piece. You understand me? I will. It's just too late. Y'all done pissed me off. Then I got a word today. Something else done happened. The Bible says, will a man rob God? Well, that answer has been proven down throughout the years. Yes, he will. But now that man, the devil done went too far and done robbed the man of God. Who goes out seeking a man of God to rob him of his car and his blessings and belongings? Honey, Jimmy Jack Corn, and I don't care, honey, the devil got away. They sped off in Marvin Winer's little uh, Xfinity car. Where they do that at? Marvin, honey, I tell you what, you need to call me. Better yet, I'm going to call you later on tonight. Here, yeah, I'm, I'm going to call you later on tonight. Because you need some consoling. Yes, you need mother, mother need to lay her hands. Hey, as you lay prostrate in front of the Lord, Mother need to anoint you so that the angels will continue. They could protect you. There must have been a little sin in your life if the, you, the young man was able to beat you up and uh, punch on you and can't uh, rip your pants off. Was they gays? Huh? They must have been a gay if they had uh, was ripping your pants off. Use a man, Mom. I don't know, Mom. I I just think it. These are some things that are crossing my minds. And then another thing. What in the world is happening to our ministers? Marvin Sappers is supposed to be dating that girl from basketball wives. Emangela. Emangela, the one with the big bust, and she got two churn, the little ugly churn too, but she got two churn. And she just a little chunk and she a little high and mighty little gold. I ain't saying she a gold digger. Uh-huh. Anyway, I just thought I'd come on here and give y'all a little piece of my mind because I'm about sick of these necklets. Ready. I'm ready to fight. That's what. I got my Vaseline. Y'all don't think nothing of it, huh? Oh, yes. Them necklets that stole Marvin's car, I'm after you. What's up? You don't want to see me. You don't want to see the evangelist because I got some for you, Doc. Yeah. What? Oh, yes. This big old bottle of Vaseline, honey. And it's blessing when I lay my hands on your throat to choke the devil out, honey. You're going to get cured up in here. Messing with me. Uh-huh. Now tell that to your mammy and your pappy. Y'all going to make me lose my mind up in here. Up in here, keep on messing up my time. Up in here, up in here. Get your life right.